see that the pump, you see that the two costs, and uh, my second fact is the roll off. The roll off is $47.5 trillion, uh, $9 trillion. Hi, I'm Charlie LaRosa, a member of the value team here at Gamco, and here is our take on the markets for June 2023. U.S. stocks were higher in June as encouraging indications of disinflation and optimistic soft landing narratives took hold. Recent economic data has revealed a greater prevalence of disinflationary trends, exemplified by May's Consumer Price Index, or CPI, exhibiting a softer than anticipated figure. In fact, the headline CPI recorded its lowest annual increase in over two years. Throughout this month, mega cap tech stocks displayed notable strength, propelled by sustained optimism surrounding artificial intelligence, or AI, despite a few sell-side downgrades and apprehensions that the market may have already overbought AI tech-related names. Earlier in the month, after tense negotiations, Congress approved a deal to raise the government's borrowing limit that helped prevent a potential economic catastrophe. This deal suspends the U.S.'s debt limit until January 2025, allowing the federal government to keep borrowing money so it can pay its bills on time. On June 14th, the Federal Reserve decided to not raise rates, leaving the targeted federal funds rate at 5.0 to 5.25%. This pause in June signifies a significant milestone as it represents the first policy meeting in which the Federal Open Market Committee, or FOMC, refrained from raising interest rates since it began its monetary policy tightening cycle in March 2022. Fed Chair Jerome Powell lauded the resilience of the U.S. growth and the job market, emphasizing their robust performance that surpassed initial expectations amidst the backdrop of an assertive monetary policy tightening over the past year. The next FOMC meeting is July 26, 27. Mega cap tech stocks continue to be the prime beneficiaries of the recent positive momentum regarding artificial intelligence, helping the S&P 500 plus 6.5% and NASDAQ plus 6.6% extend their streak of monthly gains to four months, while the small cap Russell 2000 value plus 7.9% had its best month since January. We see abundant opportunities in small to mid cap stocks given the compelling valuation of the Russell 2000 value which currently trades at only 10 to 12 times earnings. This stands in stark contrast to the broader market, which hovers closer to 20 times earnings, representing one of the biggest deltas we have ever witnessed. As value-oriented stock pickers, we continue to seek franchise businesses with barriers to entry, pricing power, recurring revenue, and large free cash flow generation that are trading below private market value. The environment is still ripe for value servicing catalysts, while M&A activity was down in 2022, it is still robust compared to most historical years. Companies have many opportunities to pursue financial engineering, not limited to M&A. We believe our portfolio of holdings is well positioned to thrive in this environment and their value will be recognized by the market in due time. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for all Gabelli TV updates. And for more information, visit us online at www.gabelli.com.